Shows keep watching. Love it when they do it too. The boy need options. Whole team mobbing. Whole team mobbing. When I come around, got the whole thing wobbing. Let's play guys. We still have not gotten our 32 barn find yet. That is the goal for today's video is to try and unlock S1 and get that guys. We have three more medals to get to proceed to the next round. Had some issues getting some medals in the last video. So we're going to hop over to the Thrill City Stunt Run and try to get these three medals here at this race and unlock the Twin Mill. The Twin Mill does have a Spectra Flame paint. I'm eager to see that guys so let's get this race going get that twin mill and get my bar and find for my 32 Ford. here we go again we are here with the bone shaker guys definitely my favorite out of the pack so far Okay, guys, we still have not checked out Here the other again, DLC cars Remember, that came out. Keep your foot down, don't fall off, and try not to lose your lunch. Yeah, thank you, Kim. Here we go, guys. As she said, try not to fall off and try not to lose my lunch. We have to make someone else fall off, though. Come out of my way, Skyline! Nick up poop. Whoa, okay. Okay, nice jump. Not expect that. Out of the way. Oh, shite. Oh, shite. Did not expect that turn there. Well, we should have enough time to catch up. We gotta go back to the third person where I have a wider view of what's ahead of me, guys. I do have something I want to point out for those of you that use the racing line. It will not always point out the fastest route. Uh, if it gives you a split, it's not always going to point out the fastest route that you can take. So it's a bit of a gamble there, guys. We are in six. Gotta try and get 25,000 skill points again. Not sure if we're gonna get that. Out of the way. There's the lead. that wall too hard and lost it. Should be able to get at least two stars from this low at least. If we can keep the lead. He would be if we can keep it. Yes we can. There we go. Two stars now all we need is to do one event, one speed zone or something guys. There we go. I've got a feeling this is where we will unlock the barn find that we need for today. Pretty sure that's going to be coming in this video, guys. One more medal needed.
So let's go find a quick event that we can do. I think there's a, uh... Yes, there is. There's a bucket list, and then there's a speed camera. We're gonna use the speed trap for it, guys. So let's go and set a waypoint past it. <coughs> Dang it, did not want to fast travel past it. I do apologize for sneezing on the mic, guys. As I said, I do have a head cold, so... Let's have waypoint for that speed zone. Turn around when it is safe to do so. Go we'll back this yards. way. Turn sharp right. I'll turn sharp right when I want. Turn Don't we tell me where to go. Right. Turn around when it is safe to do so. We're gonna go back here, guys, to where it's flat, and then we're gonna turn around. So let's do this. Here we go. Now, if those of you wondering what the dash mark lines mean, that's showing where to down. That's showing where you can go down to the, to the main roads and be on the ground level. But here we go. Let's get the speed zone. You have arrived at your destination. 153 miles an hour. New personal best. Two medals. So that gives us the speed, the S1 twin mill. We're gonna head over to the uh, festival guys to check that one out. And we progress to the next round, so we've got a cutscene again. How about we let you loosen some S1 cars for these next tracks, boss? That's not a choice, I'm afraid. The Hot Wheels people say you'll need the inertia. Alright then. Thank you. Alright guys, so we are going to head over to the auto show and pick up the twin mill as well as check out some of the upgrades for it. I'll see you at the auto show guys. Alright guys, we are here with the twin mill. Thing is looking gorgeous. Let's go and explode it. As you guys can see, we do have a center little bar right between the uh, head rest there. Let's close that up a sec. I do want to see what we got back here. Alright, so... Not a bad looking wing. Pretty sure we got a weird looking, uh... Front spoiler though, because I know there's a front one. The lights look pretty decent on there. Ooh, we could pop the front. Oh, nope, that's just to look at the motors. Again, guys. Two big 502 big blocks up there. Oh my god, that just looks badass, that Forza spoiler on there, holy shit. Now I do know a lot of you people have been asking, can you motor swap the twin mill? Well, we're about to find out. No, you cannot guys, you cannot motor swap this thing, sadly, or aspiration swap it. Only all wheel drive is available. But let's see what you can get for the horsepower. Dang it, you can't even adjust the horsepower on this thing, guys. So it is stuck at 1,400 horsepower, sadly. But we are going to put the red line tires on this thing. There we go. Red line tires on there. Gonna leave the wheels on it alone. It's a shame that we cannot do anything with the uh, performance. But we are stuck with 1,401 horsepower, which is pretty damn decent for right out of the box. Unless upgrade at all, but not going to complain. We do have the beautiful twin mill in the game. Now let's go paint the car and show off that Spectre Flame. Ooh. That looks good in red. There's a Spectre Flame pink guy, uh, Spectre Flame green, Spectre Flame orange, but that pink is actually pretty decent. Not really gonna use that though. I think we're gonna go with this dark red. Thing looks badass in red, so we're gonna use that, guys. Spectre Frost red, here we go. Let's 
see if there's any designs on this thing yet. Just out of curiosity, yes there are. Some pretty decent designs actually. Holy shite. Bunch of the AR-12 crew making these. But let's go hop into the races with this thing, guys. Let's see what happens. As I said, we are on track to unlock the 32 Ford today. So let's head over to this one here. No, not really in the mood for that one yet. But it's the one I'm looking for. T Rex tear up. Let's try the title teeth circuit, guys. And see what happens with that. So here we go. With the twin mill in red. Get this going, guys. Here we go. Hop in here. Now, one thing I have noticed, guys, is we in the live stream, it's very hard to see out of the cockpit. You guys will see that here in this video. When I get into the race, you will see how hard it is to get in there and see out of the front. Alright, guys, here we are. Race is starting up. Title T circuit. As I said, guys, very hard to see out of the cockpit. I think it's very difficult to control, very drifty, and it does not like sand at all. So we're going to back that up, because sand is definitely going to kill us. Yep, it just reset us. Thank you for that. This is those superchargers, guys. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah, guys, this thing is way too powerful. Definitely takes a light throttle. Very light throttle, guys. Yeah, we're too far back guys. We're going to actually quit this event and pick one of my better cars because this thing is way too tough to handle at the moment. So I'm going to go grab my Hot Wheels that I built and use that. I'll see you once we get in that thing guys. Alright guys, here we are with the Chevelle. Let's see what happens. Slow down a lot there just to go and make sure we got that turn, guys. This thing has a little bit of understeer. Oh, check. S1 class is definitely going to be a bit tougher, guys.
Oh shoot. This is a wild move. Drift tap. Until we smacked it. It lost everything. Not done with you, not even done with lap one yet, which is a shock. This is a huge circuit. Loop to loop! There we go, guys. Ah, shite, we just lost it. I had to jinx myself by saying, there we go, guys. Just had to jinx myself. Cannot believe we're in last place on this. Well, yeah, I can because I picked the wrong track and I suck at this pretty much, but... this. Then we can get at least one star for completing the uh, skill chains. Only 110 points right now. Catching up to the group though. So maybe we won't finish last. Maybe. If I can keep this thing under control. It's definitely a lot harder than you, th than you would have thought guys. Trust me on that. Fifty car with a little less wheel spin, I'm pretty sure. Now I'm trying traction control on, but I'm just gonna deal with it. Oh, shit! First cross section. If I can stay out of last, I'll be happy, guys. I know we get at least one star for just starting the race, so that's a good thing. Loop to loop, can we keep the points this time? Nope, we had to hit someone. Alright, shite. So we ended up 12th this time, guys. Very tough track right there. Extremely tough track, so... Let's see what happens. We got one 
metal, that's what counts. Come on, give us a barn fight, Uma. Just free roam a little bit, guys. Now, something I noticed when they were, when the, the way they got that barn fight rumor yesterday was they hopped into an online session. So, we're actually just going to hop into a car real quick. Change car, see if that gives it to us. If it doesn't, then we're going to hop online and then hop back off real quick. So, let's go grab a ZL1, which is S1 class. And we're just going to try doing an online free roam race. <gasps> so let's start. Let's go on to online Hot Wheels, guys. And see what happens. Hopefully this will help us. So quick Hot Wheels private session. Set us into an online adventure. We're just gonna hop online and then hop back offline, see if that helps. Now, guys, we are online session right now. About to hop out of it real quick just to see if this will give us the bar and find trigger that we need. So let's back. Exit back to Horizon Solo. Hopefully that triggered it. Might need to do one more race. Or something. I'm not exactly sure. We're just going to try the speed camera here. Start here. And just drive to that speed camera. Hopefully after that speed camera it will trigger. Because I really want to see that barn find guys. Here we go. You have arrived at your destination. Definitely not the speed I wanted to do that. Let's try it again. There we go, guys. Barn find rumor is found. About a car abandoned in an old building around here. I already know where it is, guys. So let's get over here and fast travel to this section down here. It was over in this section here, guys. It was off the main track. I remember that. So. Probably over on the darker section, because I think the darker section is the ground level. Okay, let's go try and find where we can get to ground level at, guys. Where is ground level? Oh shoot, we're not even in the section anymore. Hold on. Here is ground level, right here. It's in this section, guys. I do know that. We're going to fast travel back over here. And we are going to use drone cam. And show off the new drone cam. Something we have not done yet, guys. Drone cam is unlocked completely here. You can go as high as you want. No matter how where you want to go. It is amazing in that way there. Now, if I remember right, it was over in the green area. There was a lot of green near it. I'm thinking it's right over here. Pretty sure it was right this way, guys. If I 
I remember watching the stream yesterday. There it is. Right there, guys. Now we are going to pay for this to get done. Barn find has been found. Now just to go and fast travel over there, guys. I'm not afraid to fast travel. Just because I do not know where the road is to get down there. So let's just fast travel over to the barn. Oh shoot, that did not help us at all, we're still above it. Hopefully we can get off the track down here. Somehow. We've got to find a way to get off this track, guys. Maybe if I crash it hard enough somewhere, I'm not sure. I don't remember where they got off the track at here. get off the track at. Does this take us down to ground level? Yes it no it doesn't. Shoot. Well how do I get to ground level? Guys I'll see you once I find that barn find. Now we are going to pay Warren to go and get this done immediately. You reckon we could get Hot Wheels to make us little barns to keep our classic car models in? Look at that. That's old. That's ancient. It's a Ford Deluxe, the coupe, I think. 1930-something. And to think, now we drive through the sky on roads made of orange plastic. <laughs> How far we've come. LOL. Nice one, one. One, we're not gonna wait, we're gonna pay you to go and get a rush delivery on that. Turns out it's the five window coupe, 1932. When this thing came out, a brand new one had set you back a cool 500 bucks. Yep. Here Ever we are, like guys. You were born in the wrong year? Here we are, guys. The 1932 five window Ford coupe. It's back out, and check this thing out in Forza Vista. Here we are guys. In the next video we will be customizing this thing and showing it off more. But we are just going to check out Forza Vista first guys. Lifting up that hood. Oh shoot it removes the hood. Okay. Looking nice there guys. Hold on let's take that back off again so we can look at it a little closer. There it is guys. The beautiful stove top v8 very beautiful motor first car made by Ford to have a v8 stock thing is looking gorgeous we have the rumble seat in back guys we also have this conversion which will do that to it which will chop the top remove the fenders and sides of the hood and then we've got this one which removes the fenders and the hood completely Still with the chopped roof look. I'm probably going to have three or four different versions of this thing, guys. Definitely loving the stock version of it at the moment. Thing is gorgeous. If you guys did enjoy today's video, be sure to leave a like. Comment down below if you want to see more Hot Wheels expansion videos, guys. And it, if you're new to the channel, please be sure to subscribe. Until next time, it is your man Twisted Drifter, and I will see you guys in the next video. Always remember that mental health does matter. Do not be afraid to tell people that you have issues and seek help. Remember, there are ways to suppress it. Until next time, guys, it's your man Twisted Drifter, and I'm out.